this album is so special and dear to me. Um, I think I created it just because I, I really wanted to be um, taken serious as an artist, you know, not just some SoundCloud rapper, not some mumble rapper, not some, not some guy that just made one hit, you know, I wanted to be really taken serious because music is like everything to me, you know, I respect all, all walks of music, not just rap and hip hop, everything, so um, I hope y'all are uh, good and see you guys on the other side. What's up, this your boy Young Bitch. Welcome to the channel. And before we get into the topic at hand, let me throw up my hand like the bird, man, cause you on that one K slow grind. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and finish that bit now. Alright, and today on the channel, we got that boy Lil Yachty. You feel me? Shout out to Lil Yachty for releasing such a beautiful and in my in my opinion, a classical album. Something I wasn't um, expecting from from somebody like Lil Yachty, you feel me? And after hearing Poland, you know, that, that trendy song, I was not expecting um an album to this tier, you feel me? It complete me it, it caught me completely off guard. Yo, and the first thing I realized about this album when I was listening to it, it had fire production. The production on this album is top tier. You know, if you kind of like trap, if you're a trap head, you know, 808 head, you probably don't care for this album. But, you know, you should probably, you know, give yeah, it's a lot of genres and music and other stuff can feed the soul more than rap. You feel me? Yeah, so this was definitely a breath of fresh air for the music and rap scene right now. And you know, I, I always respect somebody who really, really to push the boundaries and creativity of the peers around them, especially comparing Lil Yachty to his XXL, double XL freshman um, cover list. You know, <laughs> I shout out to 21 Savage, shout out to Chipper Red and them, and Uzi and them. You know, it's just real original. Real original, and I love original music so much. That's why I always willing to give certain artists to listen, you know. And if it's original and it and I can vibe with it, I can uh, rock, I can rock with it, you know. But this album also have a lot of replay, um, a lot of replay value. You feel me? Cause when Kendrick dropped this, when Kendrick dropped his album, it was okay. It was different, you know. I didn't really care for it too much, but it had to me personally. It had zero replay value, you know. I feel like Drake tried to take this, um, this rock on his album when he did the house music album, but Lil Yachty just crushed it with this. You feel me? Like he really showed them how to really do this, you know. And it's just, you know, I, I pray, I'm an artist myself. I mean, that's just, you know, I got to give props when it's due. You feel me? Yeah, the album was good on the first time. Listen, like, you know, some most albums not good on the first time. You listen to it. Drake album, I had to listen to it times to, to really, a couple times to really for it to grow on me. You feel me? So with this album, he just blew it out of the water, man. If y'all ain't heard Lil Yachty album, Go check it out, man. Go check it out. All right, that's biz with today's video. Let me roll out my hand like the bird, man. Call me on that 1K side. 1K soil grind. Smash that like. Smash that subscribe. And finish that bit now. I'm out.